Three years ago, our Holy Father, Pope Benedict XVI, came to the United States, and particularly to the Archdiocese of Washington. And he began his celebration of the Eucharist with us by telling us, in the exercise of my ministry as a successor of Peter, I have come to America to confirm you, my brothers and sisters, in the faith of the apostles. Today, we return the visit. Today, we come to Rome. And we come to profess our faith, our loyalty, our love for the successor of Peter. Last November, I had the great privilege of celebrating with our Holy Father Mass at St. Peter's Basilica. The day before he handed me the papal bull, naming me to this ancient and historic church. It is one of several ancient churches in Rome that bears the name Peter. We were at St. Peter in the Vatican. Today, we are here at St. Peter in Chains. That ceremony highlighted the bonds that every cardinal has with Rome as a titular of one of its parishes and with Rome's bishop, Peter. Today, our celebration is a visible sign of the communion of faith spread throughout the whole world and how it is anchored here in Rome, where Peter lives, bearing now the name Benedict XVI. But there is still more that makes us one. There is still more that brings us together in a profound spiritual communion. Today's gospel recalls for us how Jesus is recognized and present in his church in the Eucharist.
impartita la benedizione solenne, il cardinale è tornato in sacrestia e deposto le vesti sacre. Monsignor Nicolò de Venè, l'autonatorio apostolico di numero, ha dato lettura del presente documento che è stato successivamente firmato dai presenti. Dato a Roma presso la chiesa di San Pietro in Vincoli l'8 maggio 2011. Perfetto. Grazie. 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 Grazie